Hey everybody, thank you so much for tuning in to another YouTube unboxing video coming to you from the Happy Piper. This is going to be our biggest unboxing yet. There's well over 30 pipes in this box. So I can't wait to dig in and show you what we got. But first, let me tell you who I am. I am the Happy Piper, Travis Croft, and uh, owner of HappyPiperStore.com. Swing on by the website, check us out. Lots of cool pipes and pipe accessories on the website. And enough with all of that, let's just dig in and see what we got. So, one of my favorite knives from my late father's knife collection. It is a railroad spike. So we're just gonna dig right in. If anybody knows a blacksmith, any blacksmith can make one of these for you. All right. I'm expecting a whole bunch of Peterson and some Savinelli. We have a two page long invoice. Are you sure there's Savinelli in this one? There should be some Savinelli in this one. Oh. Because then we get the super duper limited edition, only 70 available in the entire United States. And we got five of them. Oh, yes. I forgot that was this order. And I see one, two, three, four, five, seven LAs right here on top. Two Guys, of them, two of these are spoken for already. Two of these are already gone. So there's only 70 of this model, seven LA, available in the United States. Are you sure? Yes. There were only 70 available from our distributor, who is the only distributor in the United States of Savinelli. Um, I was only able to get five. I asked for 15. <laughs> so these were just released. What? Uh, when were they released? Monday. Monday. And today's Friday. Mm -hmm. So we placed our order today Monday. Today is Thursday. Boy, you don't know anything. Today's Thursday. We placed our order Monday because that was the release date. And we got them on Thursday, and they are the Savinelli Adogano Sandblasted. They are a super limited series. I only have five. I'm one of the first retailers in the country to have them. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous, brand spanking new Savinelli Adogano. It's based off of one of Savinelli's former styles. It has the octagon shaped bowl, black sandblast, and the gorgeous fire crackle acrylic stem. That is sweet. Absolutely beautiful. There is a six millimeter balsa wood filter in there. Oh, wow. It looks like fire. And these are individually numbered. Oh. This is number 141 out of 650, it looks like. So. There were only 70 available from my supplier at the time, but See, it I looks thought that's, like... They were just down to that many. It looks like there is a total number of 650 created. And these are individually numbered. So this is 141 wow, of 650. Wow, that's awesome. That's awesome. So this is a true collector's item right here, guys. All right, so we have five of these. Yep. Three are actually available because two of them are spoken for already. And the two that are spoken for will be the lowest number out of the series that we have available. All right. Up next we have, huh, who doesn't need wind caps? Everybody needs wind caps. We got three dozen of them. I think, I don't think that's the wind. That's not wind caps. No. That's you know what this is? Yes, I do. This is Peterson Tampers. I don't even know how many of these we got. These are Peterson Pewter Tampers, Sherlock Holmes smoking his full bent pipe right there. And we have 40, 40 of these? I think no, 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 30. 30. We have 30 of these, including like the 15 that we got a couple weeks ago. So 30 of these, we're selling these for 40 a piece. It's Sherlock Holmes smoking his full bent pipe. Peterson Pewter Tampers come in this cute little bag. So those will be $40. Anybody who wants them, 
we got them. Then there is three dozen wind caps. Wind caps are a necessity apparently because um, we can't keep them in stock. All right, coming up next we have, should be two of each of these, so I'm not gonna do both of them, but we have an Arclo Sandblasted 80S by Peterson. Ooh, somebody was interested in that one already. All right, so this is a Peterson Arclo 80S Sandblast. We have two of these available. Beautiful bent Rhodesian. Nice, smooth, polished on the inside of the rim there. That is gorgeous. Nice, light finish. So we have two of these available. Up next, we have the Arclo Sandblasted 106. I have two of these also. So that's the 106 shape, a nice straight billiard. That is beautiful pipe. I love the concave rim with the polish on the inside there. That's beautiful. So that is the 106, 106 Arclo 106. I have two of these available also. Up next, we have the Donegal Rocky 68. Two of these available. That's the Donegal Rocky 68. That is cool. With their nice heavy rustication, rusticated rim, carbonized bowl coating on the inside there. Nice kind of a dark burgundy almost. Some kind of a red finish red. on that. Yeah. Beautiful pipes. Two of those available. That was the Rocky Donegal 68. Or the Don Donegal Rocky 68. Okay, and then I have a Donegal Rocky 221 floating around here on top. There's probably another one in the box here somewhere. So this is the 221. Just slightly different shape, slightly different size bowl than the last one. So that's the Donegal Rocky 221, or Donegal Rocky 221. Then here's a pipe that I only have one of. This is a Peterson pub pipe. This is rusticated with a P-lip, and these are was somebody interested in this one? I tried looking for the messages. I could not find the messages. So if anybody was interested, I don't have, I don't know who. So this is the Peterson pub pipe with a P-lip. There's the P-lip. Very large bowl on this. This is easily a two inch deep bowl. And yes, the gap is supposed to be there between the shank and the stem. Absolutely gorgeous pipe. This is not going to last long. Somebody's going to snag this right away. Most likely as soon as I have this video posted. All right, I've got two, two more mystery boxes in here. Get rid of them. got two of these little boxes now. Glad I didn't put my knife away. All right. Look at that. A whole case of Peterson pipes. So up here we've got, oh, these are the emeralds. Okay. Guys, another uh, brand new series by Peterson. These were just released, I think, on 
I think these were released on Monday also. Mm -hmm. So I'm, again, one of the first retailers to have my hands on some of these. And again, they are based off of a previous Peterson Emerald line, but they are different. I have one of every shape available. One, the 150 is spoken the for The 150 already. is spoken for. Mm -hmm. But these are the Peterson Emeralds. This is the 221. All of the Peterson Emeralds have P-lips. Are these filtered? No, these are not filtered. So I have a whole case here of Peterson Emeralds, every different shape available with a P-lip. That they made. That they made, yes, that this is available in. So that's the 221 Peterson Emerald with a P-lip. That is green sandwiched between gold on the trim ring. Awesome. We've got a Emerald Rusticated XL90 P-lip. I believe all of these are rusticated all, too. Yeah. So all of them in this series are rusticated. We got a gold trim ring, gold colored trim ring with green sandwiched in between. No filters in these. Absolutely beautiful pipes. So this is the XL90 with a P-lip. Up next, we've got the 05 shape with a P-lip. People have been asking for the P-lips. Now they have plenty to choose from. That is the 05 shape, the brand new Peterson Emerald line with a P-lip. This is one of my favorite shapes. I love that nice bent calabash. So that is the 05 with a P-lip from the Emerald series. Here we've got an Emerald 69 with a P-lip. That's the 69 shape with P-lip. Now I, I only have one of each of these shapes. And the 150 is spoken for already. Mm -hmm. This is the 68. So we just saw the 69. This is the 68 shape. 68 Peterson Emerald with a P-lip. You want to see the difference between the 68 and the 69? That's the difference. This is the 68 right here. This is the 69. So it's all in the bowl shape and size. All right, up next we've um, got... Did I put those in the wrong box? I Let me see. That is the 69. Okay, they're right. They're in the right box. Whew. <laughs> That'd be horrible. Ship Just those out to somebody. And... Making sure. All right, we've got the 65, the Emerald 65. There. Oh, you can really see that green in the trim well, ring. That on one's that wider. One. Yep. Yep, that's the rest of them are more narrow. And this is a then. much smaller sized pipe with a P lip. Very nice. That's the 65 shape. Oh, now we are back into some of our other Petersons. So this is the Irish Harp. Sandblasted 150. Somebody was interested in one of the Irish harps. Yes. This one right here, actually. The straight bulldog. Mm. So this one right here may be spoken for. But I should have two of them in here. So this is the Irish harp sandblasted 150. Look at that stem. That stem is gorgeous. That's beautiful pipe. Then we've got an Irish Harp 264 sandblast. So 
So that's the 264 Sandblast. And these are not P-Lip. I like that one. Me too. This was one of the first ones to sell last time we got this package in. So that is the 264. Okay, there's another 150. You didn't show the one. I did. The 150 is the straight bulldog. Oh, okay. And there's another 264. Here we've got a 03 shape. Aaron Smooth. Aaron, A-R-A-N. This is, is the 03 shape. Should be two of these in here. Nice smooth finish on that one. Yep, there's the other one, Aaron Smooth 03. Here's a rusticated Aaron 05. So the 05 shape, rusticated from the Aaron series. Cool. Very cool. Look at that That's nice awesome. light finish on that one. Kind of looks like alligator. That is skin. a very cool pipe. So that is the Aaron, Aaron rusticated. 05 shape. I still have another big box to go. There's another 05 rusticated. Uh oh. Dropped one on the dog. <laughs> that is the Aaron rusticated XL90. Aaron rusticated XL90. Look at that. The XL90 is kind of a larger size bowl, larger size pipe in general. Beautiful pipe. XL90 from the Aaron series. Maybe that's more like giraffe. <laughs> okay, we've got an Aaron XL90 in smooth. There's the XL90 and smooth. I'll show that right next to the rusticated so you guys can see the two of them side by side. There's the XL90 rusticated, XL90 smooth. I have two of these and two of these. Okay, there's another XL90 rusticated and there's the other smooth. All right. Digging into the very last box. You know, that pipe fell right on our dog, right underneath the table here, and he didn't even care. Good thing it wasn't a knife. All right. This is a Tyrone. Peterson Tyrone 03. All right, there's a Peterson Tyrone 03. Nice gold trim rings with black sandwich between them. Peterson Tyrone 03. Should have two of those. The Donegal Rocky 221. Donegal Rocky, 221. Very nice. There's a Tyrone, 221. Nice smooth finish on the Tyrone 221. Put that right next to the Donegal Rocky 221. We should have like nine more emeralds. We haven't gotten to the bottom of the box. Uh, this is a Tyrone 03. We already saw one of those. Dairy Rusticated 03. 
Dairy, D-E-R-R-Y. Look at that. That stem is cool. That stem is beautiful. Very nice. That's the Dairy Rusticated O3 shape, D-E-R-R-Y, with a gorgeous acrylic stem. And I think that we did a Tyrone 221. Mm -hmm. This is a Dairy Rusticated 69. Oh, I like that. Wow, look at that stem. The dairy Rusticated 69. That stem is wow. gorgeous. It's a little crooked, but that stem is beautiful. So that's the Dairy Rusticated 69. Ah, uh, we're getting back into the emeralds. So this is the Emerald P-Lip 230 shape. Only one of these available from me right now. Look at that. Nice little compact size Peterson with a P-Lip from their Emerald series. The Emerald series is a brand new release. This is the 230 shape. Brand new release just came out Monday. It's Thursday. Then we've got the Emerald 999 with a P-Lip. Plenty of choices for anybody that likes a P-Lip. Nice bent Rhodesian, absolutely beautiful. That's a great pipe right there. That's the 999 Emerald. Then we've got I think I did a Dairy Rusticated 69. Yes, mm -hmm. one of those is a Dairy Rusticated 69. Dairy Rusticated 03. Here's an Emerald 15 shape with a P-Lip. Look at that. Nice, straight billiard shape, heavily rusticated with a P-Lip. You don't see many straight pipes with a P-Lip. So that is the 15 shape. Peterson 15. And we've got an X220 Emerald. X220 with the P-Lip, of course. So there's the X220 right there. Nice size pipe. Peterson Emerald X220. This is the O3 shape. Peterson Emerald O3. A lot of O3 shapes. That's the Peterson Emerald. Rusticated and O3 shape with the P-Lip. And again, these are not filtered pipes. The Emeralds are not filtered. We've got a 104 Emerald. Three more pipes left in here and then we are done. This is the 104 Emerald. It's a nice straight billiard. A little bit shorter. Well, about the same size. Just a little fatter stem and shank. It's a little bit bigger little pipe bigger, overall. A little bigger overall, yep. yep. So this is the 104 shape. Emerald 104. Then we've got a XL02. The XL02 Emerald with a P lip. Very nice. XL02 Emerald. Where's the uh, Emerald 150? Right here. Okay. <laughs> this is the Emerald 150. This one is spoken for. If you're watching, you know who you are. Look at that. That is gorgeous. Nice straight bulldog. Emerald series with a P-lip. 
Beautiful. So this pipe is spoken for. That's the 150. And then we have the 106 strip. Emerald 106. Are these emeralds numbered as well? The emeralds are not individually numbered. Nope, not individually numbered. So that is the 106 shape right there. Another nice straight billiard with a P lip. All right. So, wow. look at all these. <laughs> We've, got, we've got all of these Petersons. We've got, I don't know how many tampers there. I think 30 tampers, three dozen wind caps, and we've got the Savinelli Adaganos. The Savinelli Adaganos. I have three of these available. I have five, but two are spoken for already. Once again, these are individually numbered pipes. 650 of them created. This one here is number 141. And look at the stem on that. That beautiful fire crackle acrylic stem. The black sandblast octagon bowl. Lots of great stuff here. I think this might be our biggest unboxing yet. Mm -hmm. And these will all be available in the Happy Piper group on Facebook by messaging me, Travis Croft, through Facebook Messenger. Uh, eventually, they'll be available in happypiperstore.com. And they will also be available on our Tuesday and Friday live pipe sales videos on in the Happy Piper group. So... A lot of different ways to get these, but they're going to go quick. If you see something you like, let me know. I'll set it aside for you. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I am the Happy Piper, Travis Croft.